Welcome back to the Weebs Closet, fellers. I am Jake. My name is Neko. And we are back with Attack on Titan, Season 3, Episode 41. Trust. Nobody. True. Don't trust anybody. Mm-hmm. Is that a song? It is. Uh, I think it's something that uh, Rob Durdick used to sing in... in, in you, you know Rob's... Uh, I think it's Rob Fa- Rob's Factory? What? Rob and Big? MTV show? Oh my god. It was, it, it was a skater show. It, it is a show that you watch. It, Young and Reckless, you know that brand? Never mind then. That's a brand. And point is that over there, he used to joke around with his cousins and whatnot, but like make pranks. But it, they were so intricate that he would have talking with, he would talk with a lot of people and whatnot, and then whenever his cousin would hang out with his friends, he would use his friends to do the prank and whatnot, right? Mm-hmm. So uh, Rob Dirk, Dirk started like singing and walking, like, don't trust anybody. Like, somebody to prank. Anyways. Anywho. Uh, Titans. Yes. And attacking. Uh, last episode. Last episode, we saw a lot of information. For, uh, actually, backstory by Erwin and mm-hmm. the backstory by yeah. Erwin. Backstory by Historia. You're right. Hanji is now the possibly captain. gonna be the captain because uh, the MPs were like, "Yo, fucking scouts, let's incarcerate them right now. Blah, blah, get them, the, get them in the fucking band." <laughs> so they're still in trust, and uh, the uh, Levi other squad. Levi squad is on the outskirts. What, uh, they're um, going. They're trying to figure out a plan to rescue Aaron because Aaron is about to get Ouch. eight, eaten, eight. like a snack. So that's gonna be crazy. Thick. And uh, yeah, I mean, shit, dude. I kind of just want to watch the episode if you ask me. Yeah, honestly, there's no there's no reason to stall anymore. So mm-hmm. by all means, check our Twitter, check our Twitch, and support us in a Patreon if you Please. so want to. And you, and you get your name at the end of, of you're, the thing. You're, you're you know, right. You know? You're right. But the most important thing of all, like, comment, and subscribe. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> you haven't seen Dune yet, have you? Who? Dune. No, not yet. <laughs> there's this thing, I don't want to spoil too much, but there's this thing called the voice mm. that uh, the main character can use, which basically, like, it's a specific pitch. And when you hit it, you can control what yeah, somebody else is are, doing. Oh, really? Oh, that'd be cool if you could control the worms. But yeah, he's basically like, subscribe to my channel. It's like, <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> That's <laughs> funny. Please subscribe. Let's see if it worked. All right. Uh, but with that said, go watch Attack on Titan. Come over here and watch us be dumb. Mm-hmm. All righty. So three, two, one, go. <laughs> Still at Marlow. You skin this up so we'd get some alone time. Look, Hitch. Yeah. No offense, but you weren't my first choice either. Now. Dang, bruh, you better take what you can get mm-hmm. with that bowl cut. <laughs> <laughs> this is the same group of soldiers who consistently risk their lives for the sake of humanity. Give me a break. How many dead bodies do you think we carry? Annie's been missing ever since. Hmm. They were in the same clique. Mm. By back in the MP. But in doing so, the scouts also uncovered a Titan in hiding and took it prisoner. I highly doubt that the military police could have done that. Be quiet. Listen closely. Who is it? Don't move! Oh my god, it's Armin. He's about to start shooting. So anyways, I started blasting. Not a sound. Don't say a word. Now listen and do exactly as I instruct Oh, I knew it. They were drawing him <laughs> in. Don't you ever fuck with me. Oh, not 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 Levi and Hisaka. <laughs> not them. They will end your lives Mikasa. right now. Damn, yeah, he did just get snatched up. I mean, not really much you can do with one arm. Mm-hmm. I know this is sudden, but it's time for your interrogation. So, the surgeon this is gonna be interesting. To civilian in cold blood? You sure about this? I'm told that the evidence is strong. So then, the interior police are running this case without oversight? Hey, you cut that out. <laughs> I'm sorry about him, Commander Doc. Kiri here is still just a rookie. That new ODM gear worries me. Those guns are useless against Titans, but they're perfect for human combat. It's as if that gear were specifically made for killing scouts. Uh, thank you, Sherlock Holmes. Mm. 
If it can't kill Titans, who else is it supposed to kill? The impression that mm. we aren't off the list of people it could be used against. Anyway, we should get a report from them soon. So he's concerned that he could also be on the other side of the barrel mm -hmm. and get shot too. I like that because he's like he's bring, he's being logical about it a little bit. I would much rather be hit with a bullet than one of those things. Yeah. Where you go? That's well. a dead end, idiot. That's the best he outrobbed them to begin with. <laughs> You're the son of Demo Reeves, right? What's your name? I'm Flagel. If the MPs are trying to hunt you down. Then I'm assuming that you must know the truth about your father's death. Imagine taking a pee and then your dad gets killed. <laughs> he slit my dad's throat. Now we can make the truth known publicly. You're crazy! Haven't you seen today's newspaper? If the MPs say you guys did it, well then that's the truth. My testimony means jack shit. And all I can do about it is run and hide until I'm caught. How do you overturn an entire city like this, you know? Mm-hmm. Doesn't exactly sound like living to me. And face your enemy, even if they might kill you. Why the hell would I? Not everyone has the same disregard for their lives as you. Your family, the company. Don't you think they deserve to know the truth? Come on, that's just what would be best for you. Of course it is. <laughs> <laughs> You're coming with me, Flagel. That's real simple. Defeat is the only thing the Scout Regiment has ever known. She ain't wrong. True. Like, yeah, they had, like, kind of one victory. <laughs> Fucking twigs. <laughs> oh, the hat. There's no time. Not really blending in very well, Connie. <laughs> Private Marlo Freudenberg. Captain Levi. It's really him. We'll need to dispose of you. Ooh. Because of what you did. So has with the graveyard. You dropped dozens of innocent families straight into hell on that mission of yours. Yeah, we did. <laughs> what do you want me to do? <laughs> so you trained with Annie Leonhardt. Were you a friend of hers? Because one of your titans turned her into an ugly red stain on the street! Actually, no, it's because the titan we captured was Annie Leonhardt herself. Nobody knows a thing about this world. Not us or anyone else. Definitely not tr people that are trapped in trust. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but we need to give ourselves a head start on you. Please, let me join in your cause. I believe that the military police are in the wrong here. Easy. Calm down. I swear I won't let you down, sir. No. I have no way of telling if you have enough resolve to make an enemy of the state. Hey, Captain. Would you let me do it instead? Knock yourself out. Hmm. Okay. I don't know how this is going to play out. All right. Because both of you are about to die. <laughs> no, he said to let us go. The Captain might be a big softy, but I'm not. We won't betray you. We know that you're fighting to protect humanity. I think he's overcompensated by not being able to pull the trigger on the last girl. I can't Maybe. Trigger. Not with that hair. Who in their right mind is that thing? <laughs> Dude, he's fucking flaming him up with that shit. That's hilarious. What do you think will kill faster? That knife or the gun at your chin? Do you like trying your luck? Uh, sir, sir, there's somebody running away. <laughs> Despite I need a better reason than that, sir. So I'll trust you. I don't believe you. <laughs> God damn, dude. Stop! He was just trying to test us. Are you crazy? Even with my hands bound, I could have taken a swing at you with that knife and done some real damage. Don't ask me how, but you remind me of this annoying guy. For me, you're just as dumb. Think you proved your dedication. 
I gotta say the same about that bitch. <laughs> yeah, for real. I don't know. She's pretty hardcore. I would take her. Or ride and die type of girl. I mean, she she could have just run away and that's it. True. Yeah, that's absolutely right. I was expecting her to just run straight back to the city. Mm-hmm. Be like, throw the four us go. They really turned over a new leaf pretty fast, though. Oh, man. God damn. Like, are they, like, almost dead? Or, like, did they just beat him up? Because if it's just a beat down, that's... They're pretty skilled. Captain, he's in here. He's with the interior police. <laughs> Thanks, dumbass. There won't be any witnesses in an abandoned dump like this. <laughs> Thanks for coming back, Flagel. Nice knowing you. Damn. <laughs> Why did my father have to die? Please, before I die, I want to know. What did my father do for you to justify killing him? He betrayed us and started helping out those bastards in the scout regiment. He knew way too much. We'd have killed him. I mean, we killed him anyway, but that's what he did. <laughs> <laughs> hmm? You think you're real smart shit, don't you? He said a good merchant should trust his nose. You're gonna die here, piggy! No need to be brave! Go on and squeal! Why don't you take a look above you? Uh, what? Oh, okay. I was wondering who it was. Woo! Damn! Oh. She's got to be like superhuman powered or something. She's so strong. <laughs> Damn! We heard everything about Rice and who had him killed. Yeah? Well, it doesn't matter. Because it's the government that decides what's true. You're in for a world of... Listen... You'll all be fine, because the Reeves Company will protect you. You can count on me. Glad to hear it, Mr. Reeves. Speak up next time! <laughs> you give them hell, Flagel. Where'd they take Aaron and Krista? You bastards. You think you're so brave. Yeah, the guilt's tearing me apart. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Curb stomp him, technically. Yeah. Just that you start talking while you're still able to Could you imagine it. if that was a steel toe? <sighs> there go your teeth. Oh, yeah, I'm face out. This already hurt. <laughs> yep, there go his teeth. You now. If you don't turn yourselves in, then every last scout we captured will get the noose. Starting with the guiltiest one of all, Evan Smith. <laughs> <sighs> Again, where'd they take Aaron and Krista? I don't know. Nobody told me, I swear. <laughs> Kenny Ackerman doesn't like to make his business known. Ackerman. What? Wait, Kenny. Is that his last name? It is, but... But? But I bet you have a rough idea. Mika says like, uh, Yeah, she looked back immediately. Maybe. Somebody's coming towards us. <laughs> I'm telling you, it's always Sasha that knows. Mm -hmm. Told you, you're beat. Oh. <laughs> Why the only hand that he has left? <laughs> Trusted something to Commander Pixis. Whenever that crucial moment comes, what happens next is out of my hands. So, what did we learn from the interrogation? Not much. Erwin didn't even realize that Pasternik was with the Order of the Wall, so Historia can make all the claims about her name she wants, and it won't matter. 
My apologies. But Irvin Smith has arrived. The secrets of the walls will be kept as safe as ever. Oh, shit. The king's peace will be ensured. Irvin Smith. Do you have any last words? Ah, oh, come on now. Probably gotta wait two months before we watch the next episode. <laughs> <laughs> that would suck. That would suck if I had to wait a week. Yeah. Uh. Dude, uh, so, big takeaways about the, this episode. Well, Kenny is the big... Is, that's, is that's the, exactly the one that there's I was so like... much that happens in every episode. It's like... <laughs> Kenny, obviously. Wait, do you but keep it like a list? <laughs> well, I was thinking everything. Alive. I almost think Levi was bigger though, because we've known Levi for so long, mm -hmm. um, and Kenny is just being introduced now, and we still don't really know a lot about him. We don't know like his origin really, or anything. not really. So, uh, but I just want to know the relation of all these characters. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like, is is Akron a family name, or is it just like a almost like a team name? Because you you were saying that like you you. Levi and and he's a I was about to Mika he's a, I was about to say Mika, Mika he, he's Saka. a from Hunter Hunter uh, he's Mikasa you're saying they're not father and daughter you don't know if they're brother and sister if they're cousins yeah so I assume it's just like their acrimen that's just their title yeah. kind of and so I assume that the same sort of applies to Kenny it'd be really weird if if those two were brother and sister and then Kenny was like their dad or something like that, that'd be strange. Could you imagine? That, that'd, be, that'd be a little too like specific, I think. Mm. But what really surprised me, kind of like my only like eyebrow raise at this season so far was the uh, two military police people that kind of just switched on a dime to the scouts mm. just because John was like testing them. So I thought that was a little bit, All right, such a so quick switch. I, I can understand that argument by, for the girl. But the guy, though, he was shown ever since Annie was in the military police, <clears throat> which is actually like the episode after they discover who the the female Titan is. Mm. They give you like the little backstory of, of uh, Annie inside of the military police. Um, that episode, you can see that he, he said that he joined the military police so he can fix it from the inside out. Oh, yeah. We also saw that uh, Flakel basically, I don't know. I guess it was Hanji's plan originally to like kind of corner oh, yeah. uh, them into that into that little like block where everybody could listen. I also thought it was kind of odd that like there was like 200 people out on the balcony listening and it's like, did you not see those people at all? And I get that they could have had like their windows open or whatever, but it was, it was kind of, that was also kind of coincidental, but I liked that scene a lot. I mean, gr granted, they, it, se it seemed like they were, because that, that curve area, it seemed like they, they were houses. So they could have been just inside of the house, mm -hmm. just ha waiting yeah. and hiding in there until they everything was said and done. And then they walked out. It's like, you know, here we are. Mm -hmm. um, so, yeah, I did like that a lot because I, I honestly wondered why the hell Flagel was running by himself whenever he was with Hanji. It threw me off of uh, the first second that I saw it, but it's, I mean, it's good. The the little courage boost that he had at the end kind of like, mm, debatable. He was, he, he was flaky. He was flaky. He's like, how much have we seen of him? Uh, whenever him and the dad were capturing, um, Aaron and, and Krista, mm -hmm. and I was like, yeah, like, I feel like if he's going to have that big, like confident moment, we, it would be cooler if we knew more about him. He's just kind of like the character that's thrown in, in the season. Yeah. He, he was shown at that point only. And then afterwards he was shown whenever the dad got switched over to the, to the scout side, mm -hmm. helping out the scouts. Then he got the the you know the throat, throat slide and, that, and that's as much as we know. Uh, he does show up a little bit more often now, mm -hmm. but that's it's it. That was his main thing. It was this season. He has never seen. We would never seen him before. But yeah, it seems like uh, the big big people are like quite happy that this is happening and like they got the Irwin it seems like they think the Irwin is the biggest threat that they have right now mm -hmm. and once they're done it's done they, they were talking about like Rice having you know both Erring and and uh, Historia so all plants are in motion so mm -hmm. I'm just curious like 
what your thoughts are on, on that or what you're expecting. Or... I, well, I don't really know. I don't know how far that plan is going to go before the crew busts in and tries to put a stop to it, you know? I, because, mm. like, I don't even know where they're, I know what they're going to do. I don't know where they're going to take them, though, you know? Mm -hmm. So we'll have to see. I'm are super you, excited. Are you it. expecting a, a big fight since they were hiding in the trees? Those, I don't think those are... Were those MP? Did they show what they were? Uh, I think we just saw the cape. We didn't see this, the, the logo. The okay. Then I don't... In that case, I don't think they're MP. I think they're they're the Kenny crew. Nah, I don't want to get into that right now. I was going to I was gonna shoot out a, a little, like, what I'm anticipating in terms of, like... Because you said, are you anticipating a fight? Mm -hmm. Yes. But I feel like the big, like, almost the climax of this season is going to be when the crew and Rice kind of clash like rice is going to get aaron where he needs to be the crew is going to intervene in that and there's going to be titans there's going to be aaron there's going to be the crew all the scouts and maybe even some mp there maybe some other people mm. and it's going to be like this big climax all right I don't, i'm not saying it's going to be the finale it could be like halfway through the season like the end of part one or two three episodes from now but yeah that's kind of where i think this is okay all righty I, I like your speculations. I, I uh, do wish that I, instead of watching Chronicle, the abridged, I just rewatch seasons one through two. There's, there's a couple of details here and yeah, there that you kind of forgot. There's still yeah. stuff that kind of goes over my head, but I'm picking up on most of it, and I'm glad. I was going to do a solo reaction, by the way, for anyone that's watching this, but I'm glad that I'm not, so I got you kind of <laughs> filling me in on everything yeah. that I don't know. So, yeah, that's super good. Except so. for the comment section, roasting you every five seconds. Yeah. <laughs> I'm editing this, so fuck it. You know, I'm the smartest guy here, technically. <laughs> technically. All right. But not really. Uh, uh, I guess we're yeah. done. I guess that'll be it, and we will see you guys in episode five. Woo! Goodbye. See you. Hope you guys enjoyed another Weeps Closet reaction. A special thanks to our Patreons. We appreciate your extra support to keep this channel going. Be sure to hit that like button, leave a comment down below, and subscribe to stay up to date with our latest videos. See you in the next one.